Hey everyone, welcome to another Beyond Good and Evil 2 update, or should I say Beyond Good and Evil update, because as of yesterday, Ubisoft officially confirmed that the 20th anniversary edition, the remaster of Beyond Good and Evil, is on its way. This confirmation comes after a playable build of the remaster was leaked onto the Ubisoft Plus store, and some people actually got to play it. Please keep in mind that this was an early build of the game. This is not indicative of its final state. By the way, if you missed the remaster leak video I posted nine months ago, you can find the link in the YouTube description. Anyway, the information that was on the Xbox store at the time of the leak goes as follows. You can find this on Wario64's Twitter page, but I'll link it in the YouTube description. It says, Swoop into the marvelous world of Hillis as action reporter Jade to investigate the mysterious Dom's alien attacks alongside colorful characters like her adoptive uncle Paige or the valiant Double H. Embark on this epic adventure in up to 4K 60 frames per second with improved graphics, controls, and audio, along with brand new autosave and cross-save features. Enjoy exclusive new rewards as you explore the planet and discover more about Jade's past in a new treasure hunt through Hillis. Put your skills to the test thanks to the new speedrun mode and updated achievements, and learn more about the game's development and secrets in the Anniversary Gallery. Armed with her daijo and faithful camera, Jade's adventure will get you to freely explore Hillis, combat creatures large and small, infiltrate dangerous areas, solve in enigmatic puzzles, play addictive mini-games, race the best hovercraft pilots, and take pictures of the whole experience. Be ready to dive into a trailblazing blend of action gameplay and thrilling emotional cutscenes. This game leverages smart delivery, allowing access to both the Xbox One title and the Xbox Series XS title. I also love that there are a ton of positive comments underneath this thread, and that's pretty rare, <laughs> rare to see. I haven't seen so much happiness in a while regarding Beyond Good and evil. It's just, it's just great to see. I bookmarked some of my favorites. Stian Schultz says, this sounds like propaganda to me. <laughs> and he linked the propaganda song, which I love. And then you had me at improved controls. Time to get a third copy of BGE. I have it on 360 as well, still having a complete PS2 copy. And that was by Paul Barasa. Peter Austin from Team Triple Jump on YouTube also said, alert, alert, BGE remaster briefly listed on the Xbox store and then promptly taken down. I think this is actually going to happen. The screenshot that he has says optimized for Xbox Series XS, 13 supported languages. And of course, I first saw the news of the leak thanks to BGE Myth. As for the official announcement on Beyond Good and Evil 2's Twitter page, they said, well, looks like the cat's out of the bag, dagnammit. <laughs> Happy 20th anniversary to Beyond Good and Evil. Well, we cannot wait to show you more about this special edition. More news to come in early 2024. An early development version of Beyond Good and Evil 20th anniversary edition was recently released to some Ubisoft Plus subscribers by mistake. We apologize for any confusion and want to assure our community that this version is not indicative of the final game. As we celebrate the 20th anniversary of Beyond Good and Evil, our commitment to delivering a game that meets the high expectations of our fans is unwavering. We're excited to announce that the official launch is set for early 2024, and we're dedicated to making it an experience that truly honors the legacy of the original. Thank you for your understanding and continued support. And my favorite tweet <laughs> to be this way. <laughs> I'm shocked <laughs> by the Steve. More news coming in 2024. As for Beyond Good and Evil 2, there hasn't been word of cancellation, so to me, it's still in development. By the way, if you really want to see an alternate version of Jade and Paige, you can check out interesting renditions in the Netflix series, Captain Laserhawk, A Blood Dragon Remix. I don't have Netflix, so I haven't watched it as of yet, but you can find the trailer in the YouTube description. Here's some concept art for Beyond Good and Evil 2 that you might have missed.
And this piece by Guillaume is in memory of Emile Morel. He says, in memory of my teammate Emile Morel, we will finish as we started. Ciao, monkey. In case you weren't aware, the creative director of Beyond Good and Evil 2, Emile Morel, passed away in July of this year. I had the pleasure of meeting Emile several times, and I could just picture his huge smile at the thought of you guys knowing about the remaster. So I can't stress it enough. This is a time to celebrate. Sending my love to you all and to the devs. See you next time. Bye. True freedom lies beyond.